What's up guys and welcome back to a brand new video. So for today's video I'm going to be doing a drugstore makeup haul and I have not done a haul on my channel since May of 2016 and a couple of weeks ago I went to Rite Aid and I got a whole bunch of makeup and I just really wanted to do a haul and I haven't used any of this makeup yet and I'm really excited to do this haul because then I can use all this makeup. Like you guys should be really proud of me. I haven't opened up any of this makeup and I've had it all for two weeks. And also if you guys are new to my channel then you guys should definitely hit that big red subscribe button so you guys can join the Tebe family and also you guys should definitely turn on my post notifications it's just that little bell beside of the subscribe button and yeah I'm gonna keep this intro really short and sweet so let's just go ahead and get started with the video okay so I don't really have a specific way of showing you guys this makeup so I'm just gonna pull a random product out of the bag and show it to you guys okay so the first thing that I'm gonna show you guys is this covergirl eyeshadow palette and there's four colors in this palette and you guys know I really love neutral eyeshadows and that's why I picked out this palette and I just thought the eyeshadows in here were so pretty and I don't really own that many covergirl eyeshadow palettes and also I've heard some really good things about covergirl eyeshadows so I just thought I'd give this palette a shot okay so the next thing that I picked up is this Maybelline master strobing stick by face studio and basically it's a highlighter and I don't really own that many highlighters and this one is really pretty and that's why I wanted to give it a shot and this one actually comes with a lot of product which I'm really surprised about and yeah I'm just really excited to use this because like I said the color is so pretty like it's really really gorgeous and I really want to try like a high-end highlighter but like I don't have the money for that so yeah I thought that this would be like a really good alternative to like a higher end highlighter okay so the next thing that I picked up is just this wet n wild blush brush and I actually don't own any like wet n wild face brushes and I only own one other blush brush and that is by elf and that one's like okay like that's the only only one that I have so I guess it works but I really wanted to try this one and see how it compares to the elf one and also I love the packaging on this because it's like white and then the top is pink and I just think that that is so cute okay so the next thing that I picked up is just this Nivea moisture lip care chapstick and oh my gosh you guys the blue Nivea chapstick is definitely the best one in my opinion and the reason why I love this chapstick is because I just love the way it feels on my lips like it is so smooth and so soft and if you guys are looking for like a new chapstick then I definitely recommend this one okay so I also picked up some pastel color nail polishes for spring and these are just by sinful colors and the first one is just this like milky pink color and it's in the shade pink smart and I think this is such a pretty color for spring and the next one is in the shade lilac like l-i-e dash l-a-c and I think that's a really cute name for a nail polish and this is so pretty and I will probably like wear these together just because I think these colors go really well together and I'm really excited about these nail polishes because I haven't worn nail polish for a really long time just because of work but I'm currently not at work because of my legs so I can wear nail polish now and I'm really excited about these colors okay so the next thing that I picked up is just this wet n wild photo focus foundation and the main reason why I got this foundation is because the youtuber Casey Holmes she raved about this foundation and she did like a wear test video on this foundation and that's the main reason why I got this and if you guys were wondering I am in the shade shell ivory and I'm really excited about this foundation because I've never owned a wet n wild foundation before and I've watched so many videos on this foundation and pretty much everybody said it's amazing and I definitely think wet n wild is stepping up their game like I love the packaging on this and so many people underestimate wet n wild but I think they have amazing makeup products okay so I also got the matching pressed powder that goes with the foundation so it's just the wet n wild photo focused pressed powder and I'm in the shade shade 824 warm beige and I'm really excited about this too I mean there's not really much to say about it just because it's a powder but yeah I'm really excited to see how this works with the actual foundation okay so I also picked up two wet n wild liquid lipsticks and they are just called the mega last liquid capsuit liquid lipsticks and they are matte ones and I'm really excited to try these so I got like a nudist shade and it's in the shade 924 B rebel rose and I am so excited because you guys know I love Love neutral anything and the second one that I picked up is in the shade 926 B very recognized and I am so excited because this one is so pretty and I don't normally wear like berry lipsticks so I'm really excited to try this and I don't really know if these are new or not but if you guys know then definitely let me know down below because I have no idea but yeah they have like a lot of colors to choose from but I think that these two are like the prettiest for me okay so the last thing that I picked up is this Maybelline master prime by face studio 
Studio and it's a primer and a base in one. And the only other drugstore primer that I've owned is the Maybelline Baby Skin Primer and I love that so much. And whenever I saw this, I was like, oh my gosh, I have to get this and compare it to the Maybelline Baby Skin one. So that's what I did and I will let you guys know in a future video which one I like better. So yeah, that was my drugstore makeup haul and I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you guys did, then definitely smash that like button below and let's try and get to 100 likes on this video because that would be pretty awesome. And also let me know down in the comments below, do you guys want me to do more makeup videos on my channel? Because I would definitely love to do like more makeup related videos because that's what I started out doing on my channel and I still really love doing makeup videos. So if you guys want me to, then definitely let me know. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I love you guys so much and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.